Good Monday morning. Today is July 1st, 2024, and it's time for the Monday Market Report. Every Monday, we look at inventory of single-family homes located on saltwater canals that are for sale in Hudson and Hernando Beach, Florida, with at least two bedrooms and at least two bathrooms, and talk about what's going on in the market. And today's actually a very special day for me. Today is the 10th anniversary of me being a real estate agent and then starting my own brokerage. And it's been a really wonderful journey, but we'll talk about that more in a moment. Okay, today in Hudson, we have 91 homes that meet the criteria, up a couple from last week. And in Hernando Beach, we have 36 homes, 38 homes that are on the market. That's consistent with what last week was. In Wikiwachi Gardens, that area of Wikiwachi around Rogers Park, we have 24 homes on the market. In direct access, Hernando Beach, regardless of criteria, we have 30. And in the indirect section of Hernando Beach, we have 24. So that's the numbers. They're pretty consistent from last week. And we're gonna take some time and really talk about 10 years in real estate and what I've learned and where I think things are. First thing is, I have to say thank you. Uh, when I embarked on selling real estate, I never realized that I'd be starting my own broker, starting my own brand, and having this level of success. And people ask me why I focus on selling waterfront homes. And it really becomes from my life story. Um, I was very fortunate as a child, I was born in Tampa. Uh, my mother's family is from a small town in North Florida called Mayo. And they owned a fishing camp on the Suwannee River. And Mayo is near the Suwannee River. So I grew up, grew up at traveling to my grandparents on the farm because they were cattle farmers. And we would swim in the springs along the Suwannee River. And then we'd go down to the camp at Suwannee and fish in the bayous, fish in the river, and fish in the gulf. And it was absolutely amazing as a kid because they'd give us a John boat with a red Johnson five horse kicker, a couple of Zebco 33s and a bucket of worms. And we'd go catch fish all day long. And we were the kings of the river. Dry, take the boat all over there, it was wonderful. My dad's family lived on St. Pete Beach, past the grill, and he was Grandparents at the beach. I had grandparents on the farm, grandparents on the beach. And my grandparents on the beach, the golf centered around everything. We'd go out fishing on the golf, we'd go sailing on the golf, we'd go to the beach. So I've had this crazy, amazing experience around the beach. And when my parents, um, we started uh, living in Forest Hills area, so I had Lake Ellen, uh, Lake Park we used to go to. And then we bought a house in Lutz and an orange grove on the lake. And I grew up boating and skiing and doing all that with my brother. Um, and I just had this great existence that's always centered around the Gulf of Mexico. And what I try to do to my clients is give them the hyper-local knowledge of the place that I love. I love the Wikiwacha River. I love the spring. I love the Seven Sisters Springs. I love the Homosassa Crystal River. I love going out on the boat. And I love going to Egmont Key because it's funny, and Clo Key. Anclo Key, because it reminds me so much of Sand Island and Paso Grove when I grew up, because it's the beach. While you go up to the Homosassa River, or you go to Wikiwachi River, or go to Seven Sisters, and it's the springs, and then you go fish along this area, and it's all fishing at Swanee. So it's a constant reminder of the wonderful things that I love about my life. And I just try to share that with people. And because they sell so many houses, I'm not under pressure to lie to people, force people to do deals, tell them, oh, God, you got to do this. I don't get commission breath because I don't have to. I make enough money. I can spend the money I need for marketing, and I can sit and honestly have conversations with people and tell them what I think and tell them the truth. And I think I sell so many houses, and I've been successful as a real estate agent because I make it personal. I'm looking out for their best interest. I will tell older clients, look, I'm gonna treat you like I treat my parents. I'm gonna give you some pretty hard advice. I lose listings all the time because I go in and I tell people the real price for their house. Your house is gonna sell for this number. Now, I'll list it for whatever you want me to list it for, but 
my professional knowledge and experience and the level of sales that I've had tell me your house is actually going to sell for this number. And sure, things change. It's been a crazy year. Uh, we thought interest rates would be down in the fives by now and they're still in the sevens. You can't predict what's going to happen with the world. But you need an advocate on your side, whether you're buying or selling, that's going to look at you and tell the truth without having any problems doing it. And that's me. Guys, I want to thank you so much for watching my videos, subscribing to my channel. Uh, if I can help you with all for real estate needs, please call me at 813-394-4356. I'm here to help you. It's not about the money for me, even though I enjoy making the money. It's not about the money. I want to see you find the home of your dreams so you can have these experiences that I have. And you can find them and you can bring into your children and your grandkids' lives the love of the water, the love of boating, the love of nature. Guys, give me a call if you need me. 813-394-4356. Have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for making all of this possible. Bye now.